There you go. I'm not married. I gotta itch my own fucking back. That's how it goes. All right. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> that's, fine. That's, fucking, that's the way it goes, man. <laughs> Yeah. Hello, everybody. Another episode of Redonkless.com. It's going to be a fast one here. Okay, I'm trying to help you dudes out there because these are some basic strategies that a lot of these nefarious women use to keep getting one after the other after the other dudes. So you can see it ahead of time, maybe cut it off at the pass. If you're a dude and you haven't picked up on this pattern, you're a stone cold idiot and you're going to get taken to the cleaners. With that being said, let us begin. It is what it is. I was a sucker for the ladies and booze. But a man with nothing ain't got nothing to lose. They play innocent. You know when they're past 22. We all know what goes on in those college parties. They're not innocent anymore. Come on, we know the drill. You go to some girl's house. She goes into another room. You open a drawer and you find a big can of anal ease. What? <laughs> How did it get here? When you hear the words, nobody has ever done that before. <laughs> Guess what? She's an anal acristian. <laughs> anal aristocrat. She's a, an anal acristianat. <laughs> because they're lying. Somebody has done it before you, and you know it. I can't even say that word. They hit the C, the D, and the A. Who knows what happens? Maybe there's an ACDC going on. I don't know, but you know that it's been done before. You're not the first one. It's dark in there. Here's a good one, number three. <laughs> You're the best I ever had. You're the best she ever had who pays the bills, maybe. <laughs> oh my God, it's so fake. <laughs> but no, come on. Don't fall for that. That's bullshit. Edit that out. You're the best I've ever had. Well, at least you and your mother agree on something. Yeah! This one's near and dear to my heart here. A fake cook, or they're a cook faker. You know, they act like they cook, they act like they like to cook, they go out and buy the food, put it on the table, or they take classes. Next thing you know, you're cooking everything yourself, and you're shelling out hundreds of dollars a month on takeout. <laughs> Am I wrong? Mac and cheese again? Where's the nearest Arby's, man? Pretend hobbies. All of a sudden, they like what you like. They like to go shooting. They like to go shooting too. Until you uh, link into it, then they hate it. Guess what? You've been duped. You have to realize that that is just manipulation. But wait a minute. All of this is manipulation. Hey guys, how many times have you ever heard this before? Hey, I've never done this before. Or I don't usually do this, but yet they're a professional at it. <laughs> yes, you have, and yes, you do. Those are razor bumps? What else are you lying about? I better go get checked. They're really good at it. You know what I'm talking about. I've never done this before. Then how do you know about the tongue thing? They lie about past relationships. Nobody out there is an angel. And we understand the fact that things happen. But when an Eskimo brother walks up to you and says, Hey, there's been a little Richard salad going on and she was the hub in it. If they're lying about past relationships, chances are they were the destructive force in them. Now, I, I know this is a little weird. Most of you haven't heard this before, but there's actual lotions and additives that they can get to take mileage off the slot C to tighten that, pucker that stuff right up. When I made the list and I surveyed all these dudes, that one, I'm shocked that that came up because I didn't even know that existed. So uh, do yourself a favor, open a drawer or two, look, see if it's there. All right, ladies, listen. If you're doing this and you're doing your Kegels for us, bravo, that's cool. Just don't lie about it, okay? I know a lot of guys who are not going to sign on to anything that has a lot of debt attached to it. Why would you do that? Why would you link up with a chick to pay her debt when she should pay it herself? What business out there buys another business that's swamped in debt? It doesn't happen. They hide that from you. Now they're hiding this debt because they want you to bankroll them. Gentlemen, no slot C is worth bankrolling any debt that they're willing to hide. Flip her script and get her a credit report on her. If they're hiding debt, leave it on the lot, low tab it. Just saying. I call this extensive use of over beautification. Yeah, they have the long, crazy fingernails, the hair extensions, the weaves, the wigs, the push-up bras, the girdles that make it smaller, you know, the bras that make it bigger, the, the butts, whatever. Dude, <laughs> it's all 
sales tactics. It's all one big optical illusion. And when you stare at it long enough, what does it equal? A big fat headache. You ask them, hey, do you have any kids? They kind of are oblivious about it or they say no. Of all of this stuff, this is the one I understand the least. Change the subject. All right, you know what's going on. Say they have one kid and he, he's six foot eight. Who wants to deal with that? Not me, man. Wow. I mean, if he's six foot eight, he can try to kick your ass. And if you're six foot eight, guess what? He has a reasonable chance of doing it. And that's the way it goes, man. And I know some women out there are gonna get really upset, but I'm just telling you how it is. They get older, they're just not into it anymore, right? They use fake lube and other additives to make it look like they're into it when they're really not. People are like, Pop, that's terrible. Oh my God, that never happens. <laughs> yes. Yes, it does. Sooner or later, we're gonna find out. Hopefully sooner. Oh, honey, you're using lube for me, really? That's so sweet, because I just drank a bunch of water and ate a steaming pile of asparagus. I'll lube you right up. <laughs> God, that's horrible. <laughs> fake religion. If they're faking it, you're getting duped. They act like they're into you know, the good book, they go to church, they play good, but they're not good. I have to ask why, because guess what? If she's willing to do that, she can fake anything. Fake orgasm. They're not into it. And they're just playing along because they want to dupe a dude. It's hard to tell, but if you're good at it, you've been around, you can tell. If they're faking it, kiss my ass. They fake liking sex. You have sex with them six, eight, 12 times a week. It's great. Oh my God. It's a rodeo. Then you get linked into it and it just stops. Oh, I'm sore. I'm not into it. Oh my God, no, you're such a barbarian. And when you hear that, you know, all you want is sex. Don't you think you should have worked that out when you first started dating her? Not when you're splitting rent. This goes along with the debt. It's 15, they, they fake like they have money. They drive a really nice car. They, they dress well, everything looks great. But in reality, what they're doing is they're using debt to make it look like they have money. 70, $80,000 in debt and they're spending like fiends. Last but not least, as they pull this, you know, I think I'm falling in love with you. Come on, really? Look, if you hear that really early on, you better run like hell. They just want you to pull out the L word too out of obligation or something. If you're older than 34 and the big head is overpowered the little head, you stick to this basic principle. And I got this from an SFC I work with. If it doesn't make dollars, it don't make sense. And if they can't pull their half of the 50% workload, cut them away, sling load. <laughs> if you see any other ideas for Dupa the Next Dude, leave it in the comments. And don't forget to hit subscribe, because if you do, <laughs> I'm far from innocent, and I won't be faking it. Yeah! Oh, honey, you're using lube? Really? Well, how sweet, because I just drank a bunch of water and ate some... <laughs> I can't even say it. You all know the drill. I have dyslexia, and I got a few wrong here. Now, I've had some people make some comments that I'm an idiot because I can't spell. But you have to take into account. <laughs> I thought all this stuff up. Who's the idiot that does that? <laughs>